God bless you, saints and friends. This is Pastor Washington here at Pastor Regeneration Temple, and I'm excited about today being Wednesday. You know, the world calls this our hump day, but this is our day of consecration, our day of intentional focus on the Lord. And I'm excited about Bible study tonight, which will start at 7 o'clock p.m. We all know that prayer starts at 6.30. Those of you who may watch this by YouTube or Facebook, we want you to join us online. We're going to be talking about humility. We're going to talk about the difference between genuine humility and false humility. Um, and, and when we when we talk about that, we're going to pull that word from Philippians chapter 2, uh, when, in verse 6, it says, Who being in the form of God, talking about Jesus, who thought it not robbery to be equal with God, but then it says, But made himself of no reputation, and took upon him the form of a servant, and was made in the likeness of man, being found in fashion as a man, he humbled himself and became obedient unto death, even to the death of the cross. Now, uh, I like what one writer says. He says, humility is a grace of the soul that allows one to not think of himself more highly than he ought to think. It is when we really embrace uh, the character of Jesus that we learn how to be humble. And then we, we embrace the will of the Father. Uh, to, to be humble, it is a spirit of willingness and obedience. And then it is uh, the lack of resistance to God's dealing with us. We get to a point where we don't resist how God deals with us. We It may not feel good all the time. Uh, we may not go through, you know, we may not have sunny seasons and great seasons all the time, but you understand through the process, whatever God does and whatever God allows, I'm not going to resist because whatever he's doing is working out for my good. There's a scripture that says, for my light afflictions, which are but for a moment, are working for us a far more exceeding and eternal weight of glory. So when we think about humility, it is humbling, humbling ourselves under the will of God. You don't know what's best for you. Only the creator knows what's best for the creation. And so humility says, God, I know you're my creator and whatever you design, whatever you have decided to do with my life and whatever you call me to do, I'm willing to do it. That's humility. Now, there are some people that pro pronounce and they declare that they are humble. And a lot of times that is just uh, that is false humility. That is illuminating themselves. That is bringing the light on themselves, saying that they're humble and re in reality, they really are not. So we're going to dig into that. We're going to dig into being more like Jesus tonight. So you don't want to miss this study. It's going to be powerful. We're going to talk about how wealth is tied to humility, blessings and favor is tied to humility. So join us tonight. Meet us on YouTube, Facebook. We're going to be streaming uh, live at 7 o'clock p.m. Those of you who have not purchased a book, you want to get one. I'm going to put it in the link below uh, so that you can go ahead and click on it. It will bless you. Wreck, damage, and rebuild. And we're taking the next step this year. I'm excited. And we're going to go forth tonight at 7 o'clock. God bless you. Love you all. Look forward to seeing you online and in person tonight. God bless you.